So I always get asked the question here at Single Marine, you know, with the Blue Creek team, boat first, house first. And of course, as the salesman, we always say the boat first. Now, here's the reason, all fun, all fun and games, is that the boat is one of the things that, you know, it, Lake Martin, without the boat, is really just a big swimming pool. That's the way I normally come in and say, it's just a big swimming pool. So if you get the house first and you don't get the boat, that means that you just have a big swimming pool. Well, not only that, with the, when you get the boat first, you get to explore where you come out of the water. You know, you know how you get there by the road. You know, you know the map, you know how to uh, essentially get there by Google map or whatever else. But the destination is where you find the fun out of the water. Hey, I'm Paige Patterson with Love Lake Martin, and I'm a huge proponent for buying the house first. I mean, if you have a boat, where are you gonna put it? It's kind of like buying clothes before you have a closet, or you've all heard of putting the cart before the horse. Let's go get your house first. Oh, hold on, hold on. Not, not, not so fast now. You know, the, the other part of the, why the boat first, is you wanna know who your water neighbors are gonna be. You know, you're gonna wanna know who you're going out there on your boat adventures, you know. Or you may just say, you know what, it's just me and my family, but you know, Everybody that comes here usually at some point, they find their water neighbors who they're going to visit at the dock. Well, you know, if you if you go look uh, on the map, you may be only five minutes away by the water because you're on one side of the ridge uh, uh, of the land because of how big Lake Martin is. Well, you're 45 minutes by a boat ride and you're five minutes of drive time. Well, that's your favorite person that you're having to go to and go visit and everything else. And so you go the boat first so then you can figure out where you want to sit there and kind of reside and land. So if you buy new construction, where to park your boat isn't as big of a deal as if you are going to end up in an existing home. You can spend up to six figures on your boat house. And keep in mind, boats have gotten really big of late. You absolutely want to make sure that your boat, second most significant purchase, will fit inside the boat house of your choice. One last thought, come on, one more thought, is by doing the boat first, your front porch when you drive up is actually your back porch. You're wanting to see how your house, where your hard earned money is going during this time. What does it look like from the water? The boat is absolutely one of the prettiest sunsets that, you know, even if you're in a spot in the house or wherever you're at, you can go find the sunset on a boat. So one major reason that people love living at Lake Martin is that we have such a long boating season. We have amazing weather all year round, almost. What if you buy a boat that needs deep water, but you buy a house that has shallow water? You want to be careful that your boat isn't trapped on the boat dock for half of the year. House first. Hey, just just call me. Call Singleton Marine, the Blue Creek team, and we'll be glad to help you find the boat. Or call the Love Lake Martin team. We'll be happy to find you your house first. Let's let you decide.